Gallagher here from Notch Above Bookkeeping. Today I'm going to show you how to set up repeating invoices. So for those customers that you might invoice the same amount every month or every week, I'm going to show you how you can set that up in zero and set and forget. So those invoices will go out automatically and hopefully that money will then come into your bank automatically. Let's jump right in and I'll show you how. I'm going to jump right in here and show you how to issue repeating invoices in Xero. So this would be, for example, when you want to invoice the same customer, the same amount, either weekly or monthly or on a periodic basis. So we're going to jump into sales, as we normally would, and then under new, we just choose repeating invoice. So let's say this one's issued once a month, the next one is the 24th of July, and it is going to be due 14 uh, days after the invoice date. We're not going to put an end date on this, it's going to continue going until we stop it. So we're going to invoice Jack Gallagher here for uh, widgets, monthly subscription, and that's $100 plus GST. So we'll make that plus GST, so that one's exclusive, so 110 for the invoice. Now, if we want this to um, save as draft, then we can look at it prior to sending it each month. Or if we just want to just approve the sending, so it's going to automatically go out, it's going to be sent out. Uh, and you can change the um, commentary. But if we hit save on that, and save on that, that invoice is going to automatically issue on the 24th of each month and, uh, and be emailed out to your customer. So that is a set and forget, it doesn't need to be looked at again until such time as that contract changes. <laughs>